Hey, how's it going? This is my vlog for the 24th of May 2024, and it's at 6.20 in the morning. Uh, yeah, I was kind of up all night. Um, I don't think I showered last night. Um, I laid down, though, last night for like a couple of hours, I think. So, yeah, so I kind of did, yeah, but I, I didn't even sleep last night, um, and then I, yeah, we went to the gym with my mom, and then, uh, went back to her house, because I was going to do gardening, she made me food, but then I took a nap, and then I didn't do gardening, so I guess I'll do that today, because we're going to go to the gym every day in the morning at, like, nine, so. I think after I do this video, I'm just gonna lie down. Maybe I'll have a shower. So lying, yeah, I'll have a shower so that the lying down is more comfortable. Or maybe not because then I just go to the gym and um, cause I'm not that dirty. Go to the gym and then have my shower <sighs> over there. But um, yeah. So yesterday, the video that I did, uh, I was talking about how wow. Timeline. Yeah, I'm looking at it. Console timeline. Uh huh. Yeah, my yesterday's video was titled Console Timeline because, and that's, yeah, that was the first day that I did it. <laughs> that's pretty trippy. I guess I only did it a day and a half because I made it pretty far. I'm on like, um, on my console, consulus, consolation, on my consular timeline. Um, currently I made it all the way down to, this bitch took so long to load. Um, I'm down at, ooh, I have a bunch of preloads. Wow, oh, so I have to go up a whole bunch far. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. This is going to take a while to do this one, but here. Let's see if I, I'm just curious to see how, here we are. Um, I am currently... Ninety-eight, yeah, the year ninety-eight, and the consoles go from five oh nine BC. I'm at ninety-eight AD, and they go to like five thirty. So it was like a thousand and <sighs> little over a thousand years, which is really tri trippy dippy, sort of. Um, well, it's I I think it's even written in. I know it's written in. Uh, Edward Gibbon, but he doesn't really count because he wrote in 1700. But he said that Edward, I think Edward Gibbon said, and I'm I'm gonna do a search and see if so, any any of the actual historic ones said it. But Edward Gibbon said that um, when the augurs did the um, uh, counted, like when when Romulus and Remus went to decide who was the uh, uh, I guess going to be the king. They couldn't decide, and one of them had to be a king of Rome. Um, they were going to decide who, based on like who saw the birds first. Um, and so right, Remus saw like six crows or something, and then Romulus saw like twelve eagles and or something. And uh, Remus said he needed to be king because he saw him first, but Romulus said he should be king because he saw more. And they got a fight, and then Romulus ended up killing Remus. And so, but they, the augurs, I guess, said that the 12, uh, they chose Remus, Romulus, I guess, or, or was better because the augurs said that the 12 eagles that he saw um, signified the 12 centuries that Rome was going to be able to live. And when they had their secular, like their party, because they had them every year, the 100 year seculum party, games and stuff, um, and they had the last one in like 240, that was like 1200 years, and they were kind of like knowing that they were going down, so it was interesting how, how it worked out, but because they were talking about, they had it kind of worked out scientifically with the cycles of government, with uh, Plato's politics, but um, with the five governments, but um, 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 
But uh, but yeah, uh, if Edward Gibbon was the only one that said it, it's cool he said it, but I, I don't know. Yeah, anyway, um, but yeah, so the consoles, they would last over a thousand years, so that's cool. Yeah, something that lasts a thousand years, um, like exactly a thousand years. Well, let's see, how many years was it exactly? If it was 33, and I don't... Is it on here? Is the consoles? See, now I'm all curious. Just a sec. Do, 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 do. We're doing background music as I search. This is deluxe YouTubery. Okay, woo. So let's see what we got. Do, do, do. Um, 541. Okay. Ancius Faustus Albinus Basilius. So 541 plus 509, 50. So 1,050 years. So that's pretty trippy, right? Exactly. So, um, and, uh, and 1,200 years. Oh, wow. Because if you want to get, because you would add 250 years to that, right, from Romulus, so, there's your 1,200 years, isn't that trippy, his ball sack? I'm going to look and see if it's actually 12, because if Livy said that, because Livy wrote it even 500 years before this, so it's like, holy dicks, you could prove that, oh man, I'm going to do that right now, like today, ball sack scratch, um, anyways, um, so, uh, yeah, so I was working on that and I got to, you know, the year 98. So I have like 41, 40, 441 more years. And, um, well, also, I only did the left column. And I need to do this before my computer, like, does a re update or whatever and it forgets how to distinguish between the pages that I've been to and the ones that I haven't because the, the coloration is different. Um, you know, on Wikipedia, it's purple for having been there and blue for not, but because um, I need to do the right side. And so, yeah, there's a whole lot. But I'm curious to know exactly how many there are in total. I'm going to count them on my site. But, uh, yeah, the to line them up with the red. Yeah, it was. And my... Um, my uh, Roman, my writer timeline, um, and the and that my other timelines, and to, then to compare them, superimposedly compare them, and do the videos of that too is gonna be interesting. But and you could even do them and uh, like screen capture them and all together and make them flicker. But anyway, um, so um, so I'm wor I was working on that right, and then I was like, uh, I started thinking about. Um, like just as I'm working man I'm yawning a lot so I was thinking about going to the store <laughs> no because I need to I need to be loyal to my mom reliable to my mom when I'm done with this thing I'm going to take a shower or not or maybe not but when I'm done with this hey there look it's a little rascal you heard me talking and decided to rascalize so um yeah, dude, I'm going to go to sleep so I can get in like three hours of sleep before I, we go to the gym. But um, I was working on that, and I started thinking, you know. <laughs> There's lots of thinking as I'm working. I'm thinking, I'm going, thinking about my, uh, you know, history page and, I mean, my education page and all the history books. Because I'm working on these history books and my books. And, and I just got super duper curious, and I was like, you know, how many books are there? And I think it was like... Oh, man, I can't remember. Is it still on my uh, calculator? I did the calculatory quickly. Calculatory calculations. No, it's not. Um, it was like 370 books or something. I was like, wow, you know, that I've been doing this on, that I have not the complete book on my site. And, uh, and I, I, you know what it is? <laughs> You know, another really interesting thing is that Rome, pagan and Rome Christian, on my site, which is like everything I could collect until now, and that's I think that's most of it. I do have like in my favorites all the other ones that I'm going to do, but um, yeah, Rome pagan and Rome Christian both have 84 books. 
It's not trippy, but it lined up the same. And then it was like Rome, uh, uh, and then Greece was like, I can't remember. And I can't remember how many authors there are, but I'm gonna look on that. But, um, and then when I did that, I was like, you know what? This is like a tire. <laughs> this is like a timeline, my, my, all my books, like all the five columns. Um, starting with the, where, when, when the dude was born. And so I was like, you know what? I have to make a timeline of this, like a horizontal timeline. So I just, yeah, I just did, ditched the, uh, uh, console timeline. Figure I'll go back to it later and decided to do the history, the, um, the writer's timeline. I already have a philosopher timeline that I remember that I have. That I built into my like uh, Diogenes, like famous philosophers, and it's just up there in the menu. And um, yeah, and so I was like, yeah, I need a writer's just for my own self to look at. It'd be fascinating to look at. So I set to work on that, you know, to get to open up the page. And then that's when I realized, oh, sh oops, I never actually went through all of the different right. Writers on my um, books page, on my history, on my education page, and all of the like um, classic books writers uh, to make sure that it's all like updated, like that it's all like consistent with each other and uh, and uh, has everything that I wanted to have. And yeah, and I just had it was like all day. It was like most of my day yesterday because it was all like. You know, rough draft almost like, like I. So the way that I decided that I wanted it to be was that um, I would have the guy's first and last name, and I and the way that I had it was just to save space because my philosophy before is just more about saving space. And I'm like, no, nah, let's put in more information. So it was just like the guy's name, like one name, like the guy that he's known for. Then I was like, no, no, put his put his whole name. So I put his first and last name to make it more like like more modern times, you know, people modern times and first and last. And so, and then if 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 his nickname, you know, that you know him by, is was way different, I would just put it in quotes like after. And then I also wanted to put in like where they're from, and I didn't have that. And I wanted to put where they were born and 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 died if it was different. And so, in its own font, that was all consistent consistent font between all of them. And, um, so I did that, you know, I had to research and do all, to find out all that and, um, their real name and then where they're from on all of them. And, uh, and, um, that took, yeah, a long time and I think I finally finished, but, and then I copied that and, uh, put that onto the horizontal timeline and then set, set some of them. And, um... Yeah, each section of my horizontal timeline, you know, with its own background, all title at the top it would be uh, like with the hor with the columns on my uh, the p education page where it's the different sections. You know, like one is Greece, and then it's um, it's um, pagan Rome, and then Christian Rome, and then God, dude, I'm like. What the fuck is wrong with me? Such a goddamn idiot. We gotta look. Let's check it. Fucking retard. God. Now I'm all like fascinated. What could it be? Oh, my little ferret's down there looking at my foot. Or walking over my foot. Okay, so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Republic. So the Real Money Republic gets its own. All right. Because they had a like. That's where all the best stuff is. Like Cicero, of course. First one's Greece, then Roman Republic. Okay, so Greece has 12 authors, but I don't know how many books. Um, yeah, 36 authors, uh, Pagan. I mean, Republic has 12 authors. Um, so 12 and 12. Greece and Roman Republic are 12. Uh, Pagan Empire, 36. Empire, Christian, 44. Post Empire six, and then you have about Rome, which is like three. But as far as the books, um, Pagan Empire and Christian Empire at both is eighty four, which is really trippy. Anyway, um, so uh, yeah, I have those different sections for my timeline, and um, 
but I took away the images and then I, I decided I need to put them back. So I need to put them back because I realize I have the space because these a lot of these guys lived like long enough. They weren't generals or whatever dying young. They lived, lived like yeah, it was like 85, 83, like the first ones and stuff. And anyway, uh, and then uh, also the number of books and I didn't. I think I cut that out after I put it in. So make sure all that is in there too, because so because yeah, to look at. Just to look at it all squished up, you know, closer up together like that, linearly, length of life and everything, and how many books there are, how many pages they write, because that really speaks to how much information you get from their generation. And because one thing that's really interesting, you know, a lot of us, you know, you you sit around wondering, like, you know, and it's all, you know, it's a, a popular topic is. You know, the fall of Rome, you know, what do you think about the fall of Rome? How, why did the Rome fall, this, that? Well, one of the most densely documented periods of history is the fall of Rome. Is the people who experienced it. Uh, you know, like the City of God's like a 3,000 page book of a guy who was there for the city, fall of the City of God, Augustine. So, just read there, just to read it from them, you know. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, I want to read these. Once I once I get it polished, you know, it makes it way easier for me to read my website, to read books on my website, these history books, if my website is polished. And I know, I know it'll, it'll work that way with other people, too. So, um, yeah, like, I don't even worry about people not looking at my website. I don't want people to look at my website because it's like, I don't want to look at my website, you know. But once it's done to look at it and read the books, I think it'll be cool because... Love all the information that I want, you know, like a, all the t size of all the different chapters and stuff. But to read through, and I, maybe I'll do it today. But I want to read some, read through these books, you know, and I, the ones that I have on my Audible, and uh, see what they were, the Jews were thinking. But you kind of have to be in the right mindset, you know, to be able to concentrate. If if the computer's reading too, even if the guy's reading too, but in 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 to get into those heads. But but you know, once you get into it, like you realize they're they're smart, you know. It's kind of like I feel like I was like modern times you know teleported back so i think if you had to travel back in time most people like if, if you to have somebody go travel a bunch of people 100 people travel back in time for a week in ancient rome and ancient greece and stuff and then come back and they'd be like so tell us what are your impressions i think the the thing that you would hear them um emphasize the most the thing that you would hear them emphasize first would be, yeah, I was shocked at how similar everything is like is today. Like everything's the same as today. Like same everything, same, you know, people are the same. And then they'd, they'd get into, oh, but it was pretty brutal, you know, and, but, but, but yeah. So anyways, um, um, yeah, so, um, as far as like time, I need to call it, get my taxes here, but I was too tired yesterday. But uh, as far as like, <laughs> I'm working on like sprouting out all these projects, sprouting another one, another one. I shouldn't even worry about how long, you know, any goals of when I'll be done. But I think I'll be done with this uh, Roman writer's timeline pretty quick, like today, just another couple hours or whatever hour. It's not that time consuming. And I think I'm going to throw it onto the education page right next to it because it's so fascinating. And, um, Maybe have them link back and forth with the book. I don't know. Yeah, and with the between the page, that takes some time, extra time, but yeah, I should do that. But um, and uh, and then go back to the console timeline, which will take another couple of days because there's so freaking many of them. Uh, and then I can get going to the book. But I was doing a little bit of the book today, one of these other books on this computer, because I still have another like dozen of them before I get to living. So, yeah, so that's another thing. So I'm doing books, like the other books. I'm doing the education page, fixing that up. Although I think I, I finished it, but I'll throw it in. Um, I'm... Um, consular timeline and writer's timeline. So that's four things at the same time. Anyways, um, so that's enough talking. I think I'm going to go have a shower to... I keep saying that. Um, I'm going to lie down, and if it's like, if I feel icky, because I'm like, I'm like Asperger-y. There's like, there's like, 
really similar things between me and Aspergery. Like maybe I am a little bit autistic y because with my website, perfect for the autistic people. But also, like, I can't sleep if I'm dirty at all. I'm like, and I don't know. I think I had a shower last night. So, anyways, um, I'm going to, uh, yeah, I have to sleep for like three hours, or I guess three and a half, two and a half hours. But my mom was kind of late sometimes. Uh, until my mom, yeah, calls me, I guess, and we go to the gym, have enough rest to go to the gym, and then uh, get going on this sucker. But if I can't sleep, I might pop out here again and just start working, you know. Because I'm super fired up to do this, super trippy. I haven't updated the education page yet, because I'm still, I broke that part out to fix that stuff, and I'm still working on it. But I think I finished it, and then pop it in and check it out, so. Yeah, so, uh, that's what I am up to. Uh, I'm kind of, yeah, so, talk to you tomorrow.